So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you what I'm going to do next time I go fishing. So, um, first up is this. Um, hold on. It may not look like much because, I mean, it just doesn't look like much. But it is my new bait fish catcher. It's got top two plastic bottle right here, right here, and up here. So next time I go fishing, I'm going to put this in the water, and water's going to rush into it more. And I also have holes um, scattered around here with rocks for weight. So once it's in the water, and for you know a couple of minutes or 30 minutes, whatever. I'm gonna take it out, and if there's fish in here, screw off the uh, top and dump them out, dump uh, dump the bait fish out In, into. I'm gonna dump the bait fi bait fish out into this bucket, which will be filled with water. So. I'm going to have my bait fish, which are going to be bluegill or just little shiners, something like that. Um, I'm going to take those and put them onto here, which is one of my spinning rods. And um, it has a big bobber on it, the biggest bobber um, in the 12-pack that it came in. So it'll be harder to go under. And it also has a hook, which I probably need to put a bass hook on there, which I will do um, soon. So put that back on there. And then this is one of my spinning reels. And then while I'm waiting for the bait catcher to catch some fish, I'm also going to use some live, um, some live worm bait to catch bluegill or largemouth bass with this spinning reel. This setup is a bobber. It's not the smallest bobber, but I think it's the second to second smallest bobber in the pack with this hook on it this hook on it and this hook just hooks into these holes right here so just hook that through like that and then you just put your worm on there and just wait for that bobber to go down I have this which is a fishing rod holder. You stick it in the ground about to up here, uh, somewhere up here. Put your fishing rod in, which I will be putting the bait fish catcher rod in. Put that in the ground. Wait for that. And then um, I'm going to have a worm on here. And then probably going to have a worm on here with a small bobber until I get some bluegill. If you guys don't know what bluegill look like, I'll show you a picture right now. So, um, that's what a bluegill looks like, in case you didn't know. And, um, I'm just going to put a small bobber on this one, a fake worm on it. So, um, this is my, uh, PVC, uh, fishing rod holder. If you guys didn't see that video, go check it out. It'll be in the top right corner, somewhere over here. That's what I'm going to do next time I go fishing. So, thank you guys for watching this video, and, um, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.